So the problem we've got is that the protocol is being implemented in a way which is causing disruption in Northern Ireland and we had some pretty frank and honest discussions about that situation today. There weren't any breakthroughs, there aren't any breakdowns either and we're going to carry on talking. What we really now need to do is very urgently find some solutions which support the Belfast Good Friday Agreement, support the peace process in Northern Ireland and allow things to return to normal. But what the EU is, 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 is insisting on is that we should operate the protocol in an extremely purest way. The reality is that it's a very balanced document that's designed to support the peace process and deal with the very sensitive politics in Northern Ireland. If we can find pragmatic solutions that work with that, we will be very happy to work with them. So the situation in Northern Ireland is a sensitive uh, one and the protocol is, is delicately balanced to support it. We don't see what risk is caused to Northern Ireland if chilled meats are imported there from GB. So we're very happy to work on a veterinary agreement that recognises we both have high standards. What we can't have is, is what the EU wants, which is that their law should apply across the whole of the UK. So the protocol is about the best interests of everybody in Northern Ireland. It's about supporting the, the peace process. I think that's what we should collectively all have in mind. We absolutely have it in mind here in the UK and I hope the EU do as well.